Yeah. It too. Yeah. Here comes the blitz on Kendra. It's good for Texas. He falls through a nice block for him. Kendra on the run, completes it. Warwick. Play action. Over the middle, into the end zone. Touchdown to Peter Warwick. See Peter Warwick set up the defensive backs. Working over the middle. Wide open in front of uh, Damon Weishy. There's a reverse. Peter Warwick. Warwick still on his feet. He's going to come back the other way. He reverses a reverse, and this one's looking well. Steps out of bounds. There's the question. Throws it complete. Warwick at the five. Touchdown, Florida State. What a second effort by Peter Warwick. The linebackers. There's the play fake. Now Warwick's in the middle of the field. Linebackers can't catch up to him. Makes a good catch on a high throw and then works his way in the end zone for the touchdown. 14-7, just a 7.70 lead, but Kendra gets sharp. It's six straight passes, two of them touchdowns. Great work by Peter Warwick. Juggles, hangs on, and gets the touchdown of 42 yards. It is Warwick done. Back in the backfield here. Busby fakes to him. He's looking for six in a hurry. Man open down at the 20-yard line. Still up 15 and inside the 10. Looking at it from the defensive side of the ball, the right side. Stevenson gets it out at the low liner. There's some room. Uh, number one got a piece of him, but now Warwick breaks it. He's got some help. And taken down at the Florida State. So far, it's a nice play by Capers, 23, not to block the man in the back. We've got a nice return going here. And on Warfield, if we can't, we can't beat him. All those things have happened so far. Busby going big. Warwick down under it. He's got it. And there's one guy, one man, 10 yards from the line of scrimmage. Everybody else is right up there. And it's a great throw and catch to Warwick. And there's a first down for Florida State. Look at this open up right in the middle. He throws it right over the center. That's a nice throw and catch. He's got Cooper and uh, E.G. Green down here. And this is a reverse with Peter Warwick carrying it. Running back in traffic, he breaks free for a moment and picks up a first down. Feaster, the tailback, in the Seminole eye, but it's Busby to throw. Pump fake, wants to go deep on the sideline. Great adjustment made. The catch at the 35. It's Warwick, and he's still on his feet. Gets. You see, ball going to the outside this time. Warwick takes it. He knew that ball was going to be thrown late. Warwick did not. And then you can see what Warwick does, and he is tough with the ball. Busby fakes a pitch, and he's going to keep it. No, he throws on the run, and he got it there to the 26-yard line. Peter Warwick. The previous play, let's see if it bounces. Well, I think he caught it. Penalties today from the fourth against Clemson on the afternoon. Busby to throw, going deep sideline, and it's caught. Inside the 30, and it's Warwick. Is acrobatic. He goes up and gets this ball. He has a 37-inch vertical, a Michael Jordan-type vertical, and he just goes up over Ward on a ball that, again, was slightly under throw. Then he comes back and grabs a face mask. Busby on first down, wants to throw. Wants to go deep, and now comes back to the near side. Warwick again, and again a first down. On first down, play action. Deep ball for Warwick. He got it, oh and he'll score. Touchdown. Oh, my. Covered by David Evans. Watch this. He turns around. No interference. And it worked. Just goes over the top of him. The ball was put in a spot. But when you throw the ball up, and you've got great 37-inch vertical jumping on the outside, Warwick goes up, makes the catch. And, Brad, can you imagine again, had Randy Moss stayed here with wow. Florida State, what those two guys bracketed would have looked like. Yep. Clemson this time. Playing man-to-man -man free coverage. Evans knows he's got help, but he also knows if the ball's thrown to the outside, I'm only... Laird to punt. High kick. Warwick waiting on it at the 10. Warwick got the corner. He might go. 
the punter to beat. Reverses field inside the 30. Warwick is going to score. A year ago, the 79-yard punt. This time, it's a 90-yarder. Got a man out there. And it's who else? Warwick down the sideline. Warwick takes it. Touchdown. 249 yards receiving and two touchdowns. Yeah, and that doesn't count a 90-yard TD on a punt on top of that. I wonder what his all-purpose yards are in this game. He's at kickoff yard. I think it's about uh, 372, I'm guessing. Yeah, 372 all-purpose yards. A bust in the coverage, I think. And then it's a foot race, and you're not going to win it against number nine, I'm afraid. Travis Miner now the running back. He's working out of Baton Rouge. Busby will step up. Busby throws it complete to Warwick at the 33. Warwick with some room across the 30. And He's Peter Warwick is going to score. Dwayne Starks tried to bump him out of bounds. He did not. Warwick got the ball across the plane. I think he has plenty of room to tuck the ball underneath his arm and run it, but he draws the defense closer to him. You see Bonner, number 19, missing a tackle. Now it's all Peter Warwick on the outside. Just a little move there and gets a big block from the outside. Two big blocks, and now it's a foot race to the end zone. Starks trying to push him out of bounds, but it looked like the ball passed the line of scrimmage on the inside of the pylon, and that's a touchdown for Florida State. Okay. Rosslyn gets it away. Pretty good kick. Driving Warwick back to his 37. Warwick gets one block. Trying to get to the outside. And finds a hole. Look out. Peter Warwick cutting back. And Nelson Rodriguez makes the tackle. High formation. Budsby to the near side. Warwick complete. Mike, you've got to get off the ball quick. And then you got to get separation. With his acceleration out of the break, he's able to get it. So a gain of two and a second and eight. Budsby, time. Oh, what a catch from the shoestrings. It's Warwick. Now he's moving. He's untouched. They're working to the end zone. Touchdown, Florida State. He can catch right off the turf and then work his way all the way back to the offense's left. Gets a couple of blocks downfield, but most of it is just those two legs moving quicker than everyone else's. Here are the refs. And it has contributed to many flags. Busby going up top. Warwick in a foot race. What a great catch by Peter Warwick. A moment ago very quickly as Rotella is back to punt. They've got to return on. High kick. Spiral will not turn over. And Warwick gets outside. Across midfield. Busby going for the end zone. Got him. Touchdown, Florida State. Peter Warwick just out guessed him and out jumped him. Run throw here to Peter Warwick. Just hanging it up against Antoine Harris, number 26. Peter Warwick shows it a kind of athlete. You see the quick adjustment defensively by Carolina as they jump into the gap. Busby gets his pass away. Man on man coverage. And he breaks the tackle. 45 down to the 40. Busby. Near sideline, Warwick, and that's a push-off, and there will be no flag as he's still on his feet and finally pushed out of bounds. But this is a backup, Terry Billups, number 25, trying to cover Peter Warwick. I do not see Robert Williams in there, so they've got Billups in there as a backup now. So it's second and ten as Gooch goes in motion, and Busby puts it up again. Slant round, wide open. Peter Warwick breaking tackles. And Fan will put it up again. Same play. Warwick, if you step up and press them, they beat you long. If you keep them underneath, great catch, good hands, concentration. Busby, the quick slant. Warwick has got it again. Can he go the distance this time? Gets chopped down at the 43. In the alignment for Busby. They pick up the blitz. Slam Rob Warwick. What a move on 
Solomon. First down inside the 15. The ball right on the money. See, you got to know going in. If I catch this, I'm going to spin on this guy. I'm going to take this guy that way and juke on him there. Busby to the end zone. Peter Warwick, touchdown. Spent five years in the Blue Jays organization and then said, I think I'll go back to school. Kendra with the completion to Warwick. Warwick breaks a tackle and takes it out to the 40 for a first down. Busby, play action fake to Miner, has a man. Look out, Peter Warwick is great at running after the catch. He ran into his own man. Should get the ball in good field position. Another high snap handled by Stevenson. Another low kick. Warwick started at the 40. Warwick with some running room, trying to get outside. Peterson forced him to stop. Now he reverses his field, and he's giving up the yardage. Now he has room on the other side. What a run by Warwick. Peter Warwick runs all over this field. The odds of not blocking somebody in the back, flipping or holding, you generally see a flag. This guy just keeps reversing his field. He makes a great athletic move. He's one of the big play guys for Florida State. He's gonna pass the tech. And Busby drops it straight back. Fires deep down in the middle. Cowboy got a great catch at the 11-yard line. Oh, baby. Gary Berry comes over, but you know what? Peter Warwick expected to catch this ball. He didn't pay any attention to it. This year, Nebraska and Michigan would have met. Anyway, Busby fires. Warwick got it out of bounds at the 40-yard line. Goes down, fakes the post route, and then turns back to the corner. The ball's in the air right on the nine. I guess he doesn't have to take the garbage out this year or whatever. Busby off a play fake, fires in zone, Warwick, great grab, great grab by Warwick. He's uh, a quarterback just letting his great athletes at wide receiver make plays. This is good coverage by Plummer again, but just throw it up there and have the confidence that your guy is going to come down with it. Peter Warwick and E.G. Green have been outstanding tonight doing exactly that. Shotgun. Go out of the shotgun on the first snap to get in time. Throws. It is completed to Peter Warwick. And Warwick is on his way down the sideline. Calming down. Winky gets his pass away and it's caught by Peter Warwick. Bad news. Peter Warwick standing right at midfield. He needs to kill it. Oh, he did. He runs him back to the 45, back to the 42. And they almost got him back there, but now he's got Priest position the great punt 52 yards and a 21 yard return it's Toya Jones that just missed him downfield in the white shirt 25 second clock still not running it must be a now malfunction to the end zone it's caught Warwick touchdown life preserver to a quarterback in the middle of a stormy sea he comes back he gives him a big target if he doesn't come back he sits flat in the end zone and Warwick waiting Good kick. A lot of hang time on it. Oh, there's a penalty flag, and uh, Webster almost got him, but he's got away again. And Peter Warwick is fearless. He knows this guy has to give him six feet, and he didn't give him, so it's nope. a flag. But he, flag. he breaks that tackle. This guy, this guy is dangerous. Great receiver and a, a very good punt returner. State record. They found Winky. Plenty of time, and he's got Warwick wide open over the middle of the football field. Can you believe this on the first play from scrimmage? Warwick to the end zone. Warwick wide to the right. Winky with the pump fake. Warwick going up. He's wide open. Across this field, Peter Warwick doing what he does best. Early. Give him outside, turn the head, boom. He got Harrison beaten. His motto is, if we're even, I'm leaving. And missed some practice. Winky wants to throw it, lets it go, has his man Warwick wide open, sidesteps to the defender, sidesteps another one, another one, the three of them have missed him. And finally, he's pulled down from behind by Ken Haslip. Little out route, just going to go down, break to the outside. Now Haslip is one-on-one -on -one over there. He misses the first tackle badly, and then uh, Oha Leite misses the second tackle. Second down and eight. Gets it back to Miner. Gives it away to Warwick. Ricky's out in front of Warwick. Throws a block for him, and Peter's still going. He's gone through some adversity. 
Third down and ten. Has good protection. This time the pass is on the money. And the catch is made. Don't overthrow it. Wait till your receiver breaks. It's hanging right now. And there it is. First down. Ten to three ball game. They'd love to have one here. Here comes the reverse. Warwick has the ball. Looks yeah. like he might want to throw, throw it. it. Yep. He does throw it. And it is completed. And he needs to get out of bounds with it. It's He's as, as exciting as David Boston is uh, for Ohio State. Wakey's pass. He has a man. The pass is complete. Get one on one. Simmons, pretty good corner. Put a couple of moves on him there. <laughs> if, if the ball had been there a little sooner. Winky's got one down the middle. Goes the other way with it. And the pass is caught. And it's Peter Warwick. And the man, a little down and out. Doing his thing on the sideline. There it is. Six. When you've got that much time, the receiver comes back and says, all right, I'm going to go inside and sell it really hard, and he knows it's going to take a little more time, and then break to the outside. You only call it that way. You only run it that way. Double wide receiver to the top of the screen. Play fake, Winky. Pump fakes. Now going deep down the sideline. Goal is underthrown and taken away by Peter Warren. Warren trying to outrun Al Blades, and he does for a touchdown. To the outside really the timing was thrown off Winky puts it up a hope and a prayer he throws it to the best player on the field and he out jumps number three Nick Ward of the Hurricanes and he out races number seven Al Blade who is uh, six feet even Nick Ward five nine you see Ward does not have his balance and is falling backwards as he jumps and Warwick just makes the better play for a 62 yard touchdown Warwick's the best football player on the field right now Travis Minor Lamar Glenn in the eye behind Chris Winky who will throw on first down a little bit of He's got it, Frank. Going deep for Warwick, and he makes the catch again at the Miami 45-yard line. It would have been a touchdown. The linemen were in his way. But Peter Warwick goes and gets the ball at its highest point. That's the key. For Miami's defense. Winky with play action. Again, has all day to throw. Going deep for Warwick. He's got it. Peter Warwick to the five-yard line, and Leonard Myers. And he's going to cross the safety's face. The safety has to honor him deep. Edward Reed, he has no help to the outside, does Leonard Myers. That allows Wanky to have a clear pass. <laughs> Running. Third and eight. And here's Wanky stepping up. He moves around the pocket. Well, there's Warren. He's got it. He's making moves. Part to the 50. Lots of play action. And again, play action. Wanky stepping up, going deep again. That time he's got Peter Warren for the touchdown. That left shoulder leads. Kevin Laird onto the field. Peter Warwick again trying to field the punt, and this time he takes it at the 22. He's got some room crossing the 25 side. Through the center of the field, he met with He needs another tackle up to the 40, and they finally catch up to him there. But he comes all the way back. He's got a wall of, the, of his blocker setting up blocks for him. Watch the move right here. Little whoop, right back. Comes back to his left. And then the swarm finally gets him. But not after he picks up Kitty. He doesn't want to get beat deep again. We mentioned he's back home in Tallahassee where he's from. Winky stepping up again. Going an out route. And beautifully caught by Peter Warwick. Very aggressive defenses. Second and eight. Winky looking to the right side. Oh, what a catch by Warwick. Because I saw the number one. Watch Warwick go right over his back acrobatically. Loses his footing, regains it, out across the 40, and he'll... He's got it open, that's Warwick, and he will score. And it's a touchdown to Warwick. He's going to run the post. Now he's going to break to the outside, but watch Jason Bostic. Gets his weight over. Slides down, Peter Warwick wide open for the touchdown. They do. Reverse to Warwick, gets a block from Winky. <laughs> and the third yeah. touchdown of the night by Warwick. And then he came back with this reverse. Great move on Jesse Tarkin and in the end zone. So he's...
begins the return of the Riverboat Gambler. Toss pitch will run the reverse option. The Warwick's going to run over Revere. He's got Dugan to the 15, to the 10, 5, 3, 2, 1. Touchdown, Florida State. Now, touchdown, FSU. This quarterback can run. They throw it away to Warwick. Warwick slides by the first man, slides by the second man, picks up another first down. That's a better kick. Peter has to go back to the 23. Three guys, he got away from three, four, five. Sixth one guy. Three of them right in front of him. This shot may be too tight. You see two of them, and he just, you, you don't teach this. Well, Bob, Bob, I know this one right. First down, toss pitch. And a reverse handoff to Warwick. Cuts off his blocker. Cuts it back against the grain. Runs into a deep his balance. Looks for a block. Breaks another tackle. Zigzags Warwick to the 15. Warwick to the 10. To the 5. Touchdown, Florida State. 137 passes without an interception. Going third down and long. He goes across the middle. Here he is. Peter Warwick at the 45. Marishna Carlton cleats across midfield, picks up a blocker, has Cole throw a block for him to the 25. Well, Winky had only completed one before this crossing route, perfectly thrown, and then this guy turns into a runner. Look at the moves. It's similar to the reverse that he ran for the touchdown last week. Winky comes out as a wide receiver at the bottom of the screen. This is Warwick, at quarterback, with the draw. Touchdown, Florida State. This is the real speed of Peter, Peter Ward right here. He actually stumbles a little there, but second down and short. He's not getting it. Not again to Wanky. Wanky at the flanker spot, throws it back to Ward. Peter Ward looking for room, now picks up some blockers. He's loose to the 30. To the 35, first down from the shotgun. Wanky drills it to Ward. Ward up to the first down. Florida State's had a two and a half minutes already in the second half to go for the corner. Here's Warwick at the end zone. Touchdown, Florida State. Peter Warwick. Warwick ends up one-on-one -on -one coverage. The eyes of the quarterback gets beat. It gets big because Jamar Clark gets beaten on the play. The quarterback is Peter Warwick. Warwick will run it to the left side. Breaks two tackles. Side steps another. Picks up a blocker. Look out. Peter Warwick to the 29. All right, here's Winky down here at the bottom. Georgia Tech is confused as they were in the first half, but this is pure athleticism. This guy's a special talent. Before the first quarter was half over, FSU scored 28 points en route to a 42-10 annihilation of the Tar Heels. Beat Warwick to the 45, to the 40. Pete gets a block to the 30. 25, 20, 15, 10, 5. Touchdown, FSU! And the three will have to defend their own red zone. First and goal at the three, Wanky back to throw. Wanky over the middle as a receiver complete. It's Warwick for the touchdown. First and ten, Florida State at the Duke 39. Wanky to the flat, Warwick at the 30. Duke's pass one tackler, has some interference in front of him. Touchdown, Florida State. After the catch. See a little bit of pressure. Now watch this. There's a whoops. One of those cartoon moves, and at this point, had it been flagged, he still scores. The Knowles overwhelmed Duke in Jacksonville with a blistering first-half performance. Afternoon that started on Duke's side of the football field for Florida State. Here is Warwick, and he's back to pass. His second pass of the season, complete for a touchdown to Lavernius Coles. <laughs> <laughs> to make his way to, to the New York, the downtown athletic club, and just take it. I mean... <laughs> Blitz on the outside. Winky very quickly, hot receiver, and that's Warwick. Talk about Peter Warwick and Mark Rick, the offensive coordinator, said when he plays, you direct the plan to get the ball to him. And they third down and three. Winky short drop, and he gets it out in the flat. And did he hold on? Yep, Peter Warwick. Third down. Winky's pass is caught by Warwick at the 40. And then he does what he does best. Third down and 14. 
They scrimmage from the 35. They need to take it to the 21. As Winky steps up and he's got Warwick right there. A stiff arm and he'll have a oh, defense. Yeah. <laughs> Charlie McBride's guys got caught on that one. Gets it out to Warwick. That's a face mask. Let's see if we get a flag. There comes the flag and he's loose. Warwick is going to take it the distance for the touchdown of 50 yards. What a great play by Peter Warwick. Catches the little flare pass. Now watch the moves here. Stop, stop, stop and go. He didn't just beat one. He yeah. had two guys going the wrong direction. Poor tackling here late in the ball game. Uh, Here's the snap. Pressure coming. Oh. Post pattern caught. Warwick, 3 2 1. Touchdown, Florida State. By destroying Maryland 49 to 10. Florida State. Peter Warwick. Playing quarterback. Reverses his field. What a move. Touchdown. Player, and I'm going to let him do his thing. I mean, this play is designed to go the left all the way. Stop. Pivot. Let's come back the other way. And he picks up a block by his quarterback, Chris Winky, to get him in the end zone. Last week, second and ten. Here comes the blitz. It's well picked up. The board's wide open. And up to Winky's left. They pitch it to Warren. First down, a great move, and then he slides down. That split in from Bradenton, Florida, number nine, All-American Peter Warwick. First and ten. Pump fake. Looking home run again. Hello, Mr. Warwick. In a foot race. Hello, end zone. No strike first. That's who they're going after, the free safety right there. They know that Sorensen doesn't have the speed to get there. You spread the field, you look for your mismatch, and you attack the mismatch. Scooped it up and scored a touchdown. Second touchdown by the middle. And so he rushes this one. That sometimes happens after a block punt. One hop, Warwick says, let's go. And Allen, 40 yard line. And a race won't catch him. Hello, end zone. Job well done so far. Brent picks it up off the bounce. Peter Warwick's only touched the ball two times in this game, just like last year. The only difference from last year, two touches. This is the first punt return for a touchdown against Virginia Tech since September 17, 1988. That's over a decade. And now Florida State opening up huge daylight, 28 to 7 against Corey Moore stopping him from pretty impressive. Well, we've got to uh... flea flicker got him again. Wide receiver Peter Warwick pitch it back kind of hesitates it's not there deep and then smartly comes across the field it's a read both Winky and Peter adjust their routes they know each other. Florida State in their last 22 plays only 52 yards. Winky Warwick's got it. Does a dance. This is the two point conversion. After the pass from Ricky to Dugans, put the nose back in the lead for the deuce. Got it. Warwick. Uh, oh, either bring it here, just living me. That's a great thought. Here's Winky. Going deep. Warwick's all alone. Penalty flags down. Touchdown. Touchdown, Florida State. Right here. Here's number two, the freshman. The All American is just straight down the field. Play action pass. Winky throws it too late. Does not throw it far, far enough. Watch. Work has to reach back. Gets hit. Ball bobbles and he makes the catch. Great concentration. Interference would have been called. Remember, college it would have been just a 15-yard penalty. Look at that concentration from Peter Warwick. Cleveland Brown fans, are you watching? Is this the guy you take? Give Tim Couch some firepower. But before we hear from you, I'm going to ask Larry Paulson, Vice President and General Manager of Nokia, to present the MVP trophy first to Peter Warwick. All right, Peter, congratulations. Great game. Yay. You said you had a what there? Another Lynn Swan. I think Peter's a little faster than I am, Coach. 